Welcome to Date with Nanu right here on Hi TV, your luxury channel. We're walked into a brand new year and we're super happy to have you on board once again. Today, it's going to be a very pretty show. Everyone here is just very good looking, so let's get on with the show. Hi Sri Lanka, I'm Nishara Atapattu with my husband Ramesh Atapattu. And it's great to be back uh, here in Sri Lanka and on a date with Danu. It's been many years since we last met up and we had a small family at that time, but you're going to meet one more member of the family later on. My new year resolutions were achieved by them. All my new year resolutions <laughs> were always to just lose weight or get like my packs and all. It's, it's just months are just long, short. Yeah. Days are not long enough. Anyway, mm -hmm. I'm happy to have Romesh Atapatus and we have Nushara Atapatus. Uh, thank you for being here. Uh, actually, a lot of people have asked me as to why won't you have them? So I'm like, they're not here. They're in Dubai. They're with the camels. So <laughs> what can I do? <laughs> thank you for being here. So um, it's a bit you. of a traumatic day. Uh, Romesh nearly died in the ocean and we have somehow got him out with like a semi-fractured neck and a bruised head <laughs> and Nushara is looking fabulous. Thanks for being here. How thank are you all doing? Oh, thank you for having us and Happy New Year, oh. Danu. Happy, Happy New, New Year, Year everyone. And yeah. it's, it's great to be back in Sri Lanka, our home. So yeah, we're doing fine. It's been quite a heavy season. You know how Christmas is, is and meeting family. Christmas in Sri Lanka is very heavy. It is. It, it's even it's if you have... It's been four years. <laughs> <laughs> and when you come there, like even if you go to one house and you're like, we've had, we have had our lunch, we just want to eat, 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 eat. So you have to eat, you know, that's, yeah. Yeah, you have to, it's hard to pace yourself oh out. Oh my God, there's no, there's no way. Um, so they're here because um, their eldest daughter got married. You know, they are going to be grandparents soon. Oh, we don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not there still, but anyway, they're on the first step of it. Um, how time flies, right? Did you all ever think like this day will come like so fast? No, never thought not it so come fast. this fast. Mm. Yeah, but yeah, mm. I, we can't believe it ourselves that yeah. we're now parents of, uh, of a married child. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she'd been married for a while, so I got used to it. <laughs> no, so she, yeah, she'd been dating. He, she'd been dating him for a while, and we always knew it was going to end up that way. Right. But I think it. Y'all are the cool parents. Y'all never be like, mm, I want to know everything about him. Oh well, we. I mean, we. Who knew. is the strict one out of the two? You should ask. You should ask her that question. Uh, according to y'all, who is the strict one? Strict. I don't think we are strict. I think we are. We're actually pretty united. We're reasonable. Yeah, we're, yeah. we're quite, we, we give them a lot of space to think and we try to empower them to make their own decisions by giving them a lots of pros and cons and gently guiding them to the Yeah, who does right. that? She does it better than uh, I do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got the answer. <laughs> <laughs> um, wanted to uh, say, you know, the first time I saw y'all, I was a young little bud, tiny little bud. Y'all came to... Elizabeth Moy School for a carnival. Oh, wow. wow. Do you remember that? Yes, because we were mm, yeah. part of that school. We, at that time, it was called CIS. But was it doing CIS? Or no, no, no. Elizabeth I was Moy there school. because I used to do a radio show, and those kids really liked me. And so I was there, and y'all were like the celebrity couple that walked in. Everyone was like, oh, my God. And everyone had to see y'all like this. <laughs> Y'all don't remember this at all, do y'all? No, no, I do because you know what she she was uh, she went to school there. Tiana yeah, yeah. went to school. That, so that's where she started. Yeah, right? she started yeah. there, the Elizabeth Moore School in grade one, was it like yeah. kindergarten yeah. one? So kindergarten KG one. KG one. KG yeah. one. That's how many years ago I saw y'all for the first time. Uh, all right, we're going to come back and speak more because right now we have two more joining us. Um, well, let me just tell you about them. One is older than the other, but both are the kids of theirs. So, so this is my second time on this program. And uh, I think I've known Danu for about, I want to say 12 years. And uh, he's a great guy. I promised myself I'm going to be nice <laughs> this time. And um, yeah, he's great at what he does. Uh, love the charity work he does as well. So, planning to have uh, fun this time. 
Hi, I'm Tiana. I was last on the show years ago, so it's always good to be back and chatting with Uncle Danu. Um, I haven't been back to Sri Lanka in many, many years, so it's really nice to be home. Welcome back to the show, and right now we have the two kids. We have Deepak. Uh, and we have Tiana. This is uh, a rumor start, man, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> I prom you're older than Romesh. <laughs> I don't think... I don't think... I don't think you could have had... But you have somehow, ma somehow made yourself a part of their family. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, so they've known me since I was 13. Yeah. yeah. And Michelle would have been 12. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um... Congratulations on your wedded life. Thank you. So you, uh, how is life in Canada? It's cold. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's actually good. good. <laughs> yeah, actually, like, I do feel like I get frost, uh, frostbite every winter a little bit, but, you know, you get on do with it. Do you have it. to, like, do the whole wake up in the morning, clean the driveway, the snow no, 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 no. I don't live in a Anywhere house. Anywhere in one of the, <laughs> uh, even in an apartment. Yeah, I Thank chose God. this very, very specifically because I did not want to be, and I did live in a house, like, in my student years, and that driveway was awful, and I said, I never will live in a house in this country. And is it safe to drive there? You're asking the wrong person, because every time I try to take my license, it starts to snow. And Ma <laughs> Mama gets really mad about this, because she's been trying to get me to take my license. But every time the classes come, it's like, there's snow up to here, yeah, and I'm like, yeah. I'm not driving in this, True. so. We have a lot of people who watch the show from Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out. <laughs> so, Deepak, how do you know Nushara? So, uh, when I was around 13, she did a Bata commercial with my brother, my elder brother. Oh. And uh, then she soon became like family friends. So my sisters and my brother and myself used to hang out with her. Not you. Tell me the truth. I was a little young, okay? <laughs> <laughs> How did it happen? But she did know me. <laughs> I did, uh, yes, I did know him because he was always around. We used to c come home and we used to play games like Pictionary and yeah. whatever board games. And we just have some really good yeah, fun. Bowler, and yeah, and then deep like up. What the 90s did. <laughs> <laughs> no, we had proper board games. <laughs> 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 board games, yeah. <laughs> like, hey, and drawn. <laughs> Sneak and ladder. <laughs> and we used little rocks because we didn't have those little plastic pieces. <laughs> like the flint stones. <laughs> okay, so at that time? Yeah, so uh, I mean, Deepak was also there and he would well, always request to also join us. He said, Can I also come and play? And uh, we were like, We would feel so bad. Yeah, he was, of course, you can come, and, come, and, come, and, come and join us. But you know what? He was, he's such a talented artist, so it was quite beneficial to have him come and play a Pictionary with us as well. So he would hang out with us as well. So that's how. Yeah. yeah. And then so your brother was the original model. He in was the, the original model in the family. Yeah, yeah. He's much better looking. But he, he really is, though. I mean, I tell everyone. <laughs> so you were just what? Because they couldn't get your brother, they used to get you. Honestly, that was it. This is the first. No, so I, oh, no. What happened was I started when I was 17. So that's because this lady he uh, asked my brother to do a commercial, which he refused to do, and then who? Asked, uh, this lady who used to oh, okay. coordinate models. And uh, she called my mom. She's like, oh, since the elder guy's not willing to do it, does the younger boy want to? And I was like, yes. <laughs> so okay. that's how my career started, yeah. You were a charity case. Yes, I was, a, <laughs> <laughs> I was an afterthought. <laughs> it had to do with an elder man. Somehow. It worked out well. Yeah, brilliant. And you somehow kicked him out of the country. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah. I like, See, <laughs> I'm saying that for chat. Um, all right, so then you got to know Romesh. Romesh, what was your first thoughts about Deepa? My first thought, it's a cute kid. Oh, kid. Oh. He's a nice kid. Yeah, he was a nice kid. I remember. Yeah, he is. That's why we all buggy men love him at the same time. Oh. Yeah. Enough done. We are done about Deepak. Now. <laughs> Let's get into a break. We're coming back with some very terrible questions. After this. Let's get into our first segment, and it's called Austin. Right, so these questions, I have to do it in a way thinking that Chanel was also coming. So her questions are also around. Uh, and at the same time, there are specific questions which I have planned for a few. Like Romesh, who is not in the, in the scene where drama can be created. Okay, yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, his scene can be quite dramatic at times. Oh, really? Yeah. 
corporate world. <laughs> so Ramesh has walked the ramp as, uh, ramp as well. I'm sure. Back in the day. And he's done quite what? a few commercials. Walked the ramp? Yeah, once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I used to drag him on. Tripped over. <laughs> tripped down the ramp. <laughs> you never liked that? No, yeah. never actually. Oh, that was because that. there was this fashion, not fashion show, or hair it's show that we did. Show. Bridal show. And I had to wear my bridal um, dress yeah. again. Right. And so. Um, they were like, we need a husband. Me need a husband. He didn't want anyone else to walk with me in that dress, so oh, that he came. Fair enough. It's, it's fair. Yeah, that's sentimental. <laughs> of yeah. course, yeah. of course. That's sweet, though. All right. <laughs> Here are other questions. This is specifically for Deepak and Nushara. Geraldine Nadika Pereira, Audrey Rizal Plunkett, your favorite on the ramp? Nadika. Geraldine, Geraldine. Geraldine uh, Bandar and I, I'm thinking of. No. Oh, no. I'm thinking of, okay, my era is quite back. <laughs> that's be even before. Huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> she was. I'm thinking. Sorry, I, I was thinking. I thought he was the same. No, Jeremy. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, Nadika. All are good. Nadika. Yeah. Okay. Did you ever have to do any favors to get? Yo. What? What? <laughs> he answered it first. <laughs> no, no. To um, be in the. No, no. Impulsive guy. <laughs> huh? Sorry. Can you repeat the question? Only the guilty speak fast. No, <laughs> I want to say this. I want to say this. Okay, I did, I got, okay, okay, fine. So. Uh, did you do any favors to get on this show? Is what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> and you jumped the gun. Was there, were, were there people who offered more than what when you went for shows? Were there people who tried to be funny with you? No, I've never really had to do anything. I've yeah, never done have anything. Have others tried? It's been a long time ago. Oh, you know, you had people who always tried to be funny with you, especially it happens after a show. But my policy always has been when I used to model, I used to do my shows and I used to make sure there was someone to pick me up and I'd leave. I used to leave, exit the show. Because I, I, I know this stuff used to happen. Mm. So maybe, yeah, before that. that Did you happen. leave Deepak? <laughs> okay, I have to say that she, because I started when I was 17. And Nishara was already like a really good friend. And she gave me that advice. So you also <coughs> left? No. <laughs> no, because I was young. Oh, and then it was just like, because we were always asked to stay for cocktails, you know, at events and stuff. And then obviously, you know, I got, it just, so what I want to say. Were you abused? What? Were you abused? No. <laughs> what? You just said you stayed back and there was cocktails and all. Yeah, and no, so that's why so I was going to continue what I was going to say. <laughs> uh, so there have been rumors. That go, that go on in the industry and stuff. But it's how you conduct yourself. Mm -hmm. So we weren't approached and all that. So not by people in the industry. They treated us really well. I know how they treated her as well. You know, they really loved and respected her. It's the people in the outside, like the, the business yeah. people, the clients right. and stuff yeah. who try to. Like me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you, this is for everyone. If you were a fly, if you can be a fly on a wall in the year 2023, Whose wall would you like to sit on and spy on any conversation? Vladimir Putin. Wow, wow yes. I'd like to know what okay. he's going to do oh, next. Fair enough. You, that's <laughs> you being a fly. You? I don't know. I haven't thought about that. I don't really want to sit on anyone's wall. Everyone can mind their own business. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm with her on that. I really don't. I kind of like stick in my own lane. <laughs> I don't want to be a fly, man. Why can't it be like a... <laughs> like an eagle or something. I don't want to be sitting on crap and then flying through. Actually, I would be a bird too. I, I yeah, like an yeah. eagle disorder. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> but I want to sit on someone's caca. <laughs> That's because he now he has such. He is a very smart fly. And you just wanted to go sit. But then at some point he did sit on someone's no, crap and then flew to Putin. <laughs> how would you know? It must have been Putin's crap as well. You know? That's disgusting. God. <laughs> Describe high society in one word. Pretentious. Oh. Like Sri Lankan? Yes. I don't know. I don't live oh, you don't here. Even, yeah. <laughs> um, How do you put that in one word? High mm -hmm. society in one word. It, it depends because you can't you can't actually say that everyone in high society is pretentious, no. right? No. That's like you just sort of like slammed everybody in that. Gosh, category. I'm sorry. <laughs> but, <laughs> but you have the one word. I just came. But it's, it's maybe no, I agree a, with it's, what you're it's, it's a generalization. It's not a blanket statement. It's a hard generalization to yeah. make. What she said. I'll say hard to make friends. 
hard to make friends. That's a, yeah, but that's not one word, but yeah. That's Sorry. fine. Yeah, but <laughs> <laughs> one liner. Right, one yeah, liner. That's fine. Thank you. Seneca Lochin Michael, your favorite personal designer. Oh yeah, Nishara, answer that oh. one. <laughs> I mean, I love all of them. Actually, all three of them are really close friends of mine, and I, I love and respect Desi it. Personal, personal designer, designer is Loaching because he's he's done a lot of clothes for me. In you fact, have not been dressed by anyone. I actually have been dressed by Uncle Loaching, so I'm gonna okay. say Uncle Loaching. And he helped. <laughs> um, he did her her yeah, dress for the the wedding reception. I saw it. Uh, Darshi did the fabric. Uh, uh, yes, it was stunning. it was a it was a three designer creation. creation. Loaching, uh, Damika Amarsekra, and Darshi did the same. Yeah. And you, uh, Michael. <clears throat> okay. Uh, if the movie Speed were to be made in Sri Lanka as Vega, as what? Vega. Speed. Speed. Okay. Who would you cast to be the CTV bus? Uh, <laughs> to be driving it? No. no, just the bus. The bus. Who would you cast to be the bus? Somebody has to be the bus. Okay. It's a hypothetical question. And then someone's going to ride the bus? Yeah. <laughs> who is going to be Sandra? And who is going to be. Um, Keanu. Yeah. <laughs> Keanu Reeves. Mm. Who will you cast as the bus? I'm having a really so weird we'll magic have, picture right now. Uh, we'll have uh, you as the bus, you as Sandra, you as Keanu. <laughs> Who is Sandra Deepak? I've got to be the bus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the bus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting a ride. <laughs> and it's Ramesh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Hop on in. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Um, <laughs> is, he getting, <laughs> is he getting a bit warm now? What? <laughs> okay, that's it. I think I have to let go of the other questions because of the fact that some people didn't make it on the show. Chanel, see what have you done to me? Anyway, <laughs> considering the fact that the one who was honest is Ramesh, I'm giving this to you. Oh, thank you. Oh, hey. So you're not, you, you took the fly question perfectly. You didn't like question me about the question. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. All right, we'll see you right after. Welcome back to the show. It's a date with Danu, and we are uh, in the new year. And I have some fabulous people who are flying off immediately after this show. So I'm so happy. Not Deepak, but the others. So <laughs> just just wanted to quickly Stuck catch here. yeah <laughs> catch <laughs> catch them. Um, I wanted to ask you. So Ramesh, what keeps you busy in Dubai? Um, generally, my work, which is banking and finance, and otherwise it's family and a little bit of fitness. Little bit. Exactly, and it's being really modest. You know that. Uh, so, uh, well, both of us have the membership in the same gym when he's in Sri Lanka, um, and this is me trying to like. Uh, 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 and this one has just landed and has come from Katunaika to the gym. It's so really the only unfair. thing that keeps you sane. That's why. That's really, why, yeah. it drove me insane. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so that's great. So this this thing towards fitness, is it like in the whole family? Are you all the same? Well, I can't think it kind of rubs off on you when someone's like at you the gym so all... You guilty, Yeah, right? you just can't like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my, my, my thing was you can eat as much as you like and uh, run, well, eat like a horse and run like two, but <laughs> can't do that anymore as it's as you grow older. So. What have you stopped running like a horse or eating like just a horse? the one horse? Eating. Only one horse. One horse. Yeah. 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 Are you a fitness one too? Not, not like him. Uh, he actually has been taking Ray out to the gym a lot. Since which before you. Before before yeah. we even got married. So like he's kind of made him a very much oh, a fitness right. tree. So it's the same kind of effect that I have now. So as he's my also mom. everyday gym. 
No, not as often as him, but still quite often. But they're often. climbers. They do rock climbing. We do rock climbing. Yeah. So we go oh, kind of like bouldering. So it's like climbing without Oh, you are more them. outdoor activity kind of It's person. actually an indoor gym. So because it's, it's cold snowing. outside. Oh, yeah, sorry. I can't <laughs> climb half <laughs> of the <laughs> summer. Canada. Canada. That's my one month of yeah. summer. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, I wanted to ask you, you had some offers coming in your way for movies and all, right? Mm. And you had like a photo shoot. And tell me about... Are you working towards those plans? So about two years ago, I did um, a film. So I was doing wow. this one called. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> it was called Quickening, and it was at the. Quickening. Yeah. It what was, does that even mean? It's actually so basically it's about like this the feeling of being pregnant but you're not pregnant. So oh, right, that's right. the concept. But it's um, it was a South Asian film in Canada, and it was about like this immigrant story of this Pakistani girl who was trying to balance between her family and then like social life. And I played like one of the characters for it and then it went to the Toronto International Film Festival. That's so amazing. That was, that was fun, but now I'm kind of transitioning into more hosting and presenting in Canada. So I've been doing like telling the stories a bit more of like the food and the restaurants and the businesses there. Yeah. That's brilliant. Because you know, uh, how was it for you to get in front of the camera and act was it like a was it a feeling that you have always felt comfortable with I think so just because I used to do acting classes from such a young age in Dubai so it was a very natural Easy transition. transition in that way it wasn't a scary thing for me so but what what she did have to learn uh, in Canada I think was doing it in front of camera because she did stage acting right mm. and then moving in mm. And but that's the best not, way to yeah. go, actually. Stage to cinema is the best and not cinema to stage because you'll never know how to act. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen movie people acting? They're terrible. They only act for those five minutes. But it's the <laughs> truth. <laughs> because they don't need to be in character always. Yeah. So mm -hmm. You learn the true craft on stage. So amazing. Mm -hmm. Well done. Uh, Deepak, it's remarkable that you still, at this age, <laughs> You're still in shape. You look fabulous. Oh, you, you walk the ramp even this year for Colombo Fashion Week. How, how, how do you do it? Apart from being motivated by me. Yeah, know, no, yeah. dude. I, I scroll through Instagram every day. And, and you're like out man, of you know? the gym, out yeah, yeah. to the gym immediately. Even during COVID, you were consistent. Look, it's a choice you had to make because I was getting older. As Rome was saying, at some point, your body just feels different. Like, mm. you know, when you were in your 20s. So, uh, you just had to, I just got up one day, to, you know, I decided, like, this is what, how I want to look and feel. And it's not necessarily about the way you look. That's just like a, a positive byproduct of mm. just staying healthy. So what he was saying as well, it's just being, uh, like, I can't eat like I did in my 20s. Like, even though I was a slim kid, I could eat what I want to. It's like your body just stops working after mm. a certain age. So I'm conscious about like I'm waiting for mine to stop working. <laughs> so, so when I'm at home, and the good thing is uh, with my professional career, I work a lot from home. Yeah. So I uh, I'm very conscious of what I eat. Obviously, when I go out, not too much. Mm. But since I spend a lot of time at home, I can control. But also, Deepa met with one fabulous accident, which nearly killed him. Yeah. <coughs> so that was another reason because um, so before that, I was just uh, not really conscious about my food, but just sort of like working out really hard. But that actually helped when the accident actually happened. Thankfully, I had enough muscle to uh, protect you. Yeah, to absorb a lot of the shock. And um, so you don't need fat to absorb the shock. You lot, need muscle. I mean, I wasn't. I don't know. Just <laughs> wanted. <laughs> Let me check with my doctor and I'll get. I just need to know that information. Uh, we have another segment, and it's called Yes or No. Please be truthful. It's a very simple game. You have to be honest, uh, considering the fact that these ones can be very honest. Deepa, please try. Um, <clears throat> let's go. Do you feel happy living the life you have right now? Do you think being nice is better than being fair? Bad are you? <laughs> She's you undecided. You to be fair as well, and <laughs> I'm just trying to. Think, but it's good to be nice. Have you ever been sexually attracted to a friend of yours? What's the question? Have, Have you, you ever been sexually attracted to a friend of yours? Mm. Maybe. 
Okay, now spill the beans. Oh, <laughs> no. sorry. Yes, of course. <laughs> Are there still friends in your lives? I just want to know. Yes. Not I'm in just touch. friends. Huh? Not in touch. <laughs> <laughs> not touching or not in touch? Not in touch. <laughs> you? I married my friend. Yeah, oh. Oh, oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> How old were you when you started dating? Like, I don't know, 16. Yeah, so. Yeah, that's I knew Deepak will say yes. It's not, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Always, you Yes, know. yeah, and we're in touch, so. I know, yeah. and I have to like sometimes just peel his hand off my body. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, Again, these are rumors that <laughs> if you If you won the lottery, would you tell your family or friends? Family? Friends? <laughs> <laughs> Like bad friends. Because like, yeah, 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 nothing, nothing. we have lived life. <laughs> you, you have yeah, you're you're too like the latest life. Yeah, exactly. She's you, too young and too innocent. Yeah, exactly. Give her, give her about 10 know. years. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're for the latest Lambo. Yeah, yeah. I like, work really hard for it. Um, okay. Do you think white lies are justifiable in a relationship? No, 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 no. Oh, no. wow. Really? No, <laughs> white lies, not like the real lies. No, That's just no a lie. lies. No. In a relationship. I think it's just like a gateway to. God, yeah. <laughs> <It's still alive>. <laughs> <laughs> um, Have you ever shoplifted for the fun of it? <laughs> <laughs> Disappointing cry. <laughs> <laughs> Do people usually form the wrong idea about you, or of you? Oh. Yes. No. Oh, you don't even know that. <laughs> yeah, I know. We're assuming, we're, assuming that, we're assuming that everyone loves us. That's fine. Being positive is a great thing. There you go. There you go. Maybe this, is, this could be after the dive. <laughs> you have forgotten certain areas of your life. OK. Uh, do you think friends are the same level of importance as family? Oh, what do you, friends are the same level of for me? Well. I mean, it depends on the person. She checked my just like <laughs> no, no, I didn't, no, I didn't, I, because the family given, is yes. always first. Right? Yeah, I mean, I love yeah. my friends as well, but I mean. Uh, no, look. You I'm ain't there, darling. <laughs> <laughs> We're friends and I treat them like family, so. Yeah, but only you. They I have know, put I know, you I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, so, so you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Deepak, on that note, I mean, I'm, really I'm going to give you this box because oh. you deserve it. You don't have You have to be kicked to the <laughs> curb by these ones. <laughs> <laughs> you are just not as loved as how much you love them. Oh, oh, no. that's, that's okay. That's, that's it's really not true. true. It, wasn't, it, wasn't, it has been a challenge. <laughs> this is for you. Oh, uh, let's get into a break. We'll see you on the other side. You'll stick around. You'll stick around. I'm very worried to do this segment because all of these ones have a bit of a halo running all over them. But let's see how this goes. This is our cute. All of you look a bit scared. We're really scared. What's in the bag? What's in the bag? <laughs> What's in the bag? Whips and chains. Ooh. <laughs> and all of it. Uh, what's your size, Deepa? It's a double XL. Really? You might have to connect two together then. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> OK, here's a question. <laughs> Got a mental picture, didn't you? <laughs> Here's the question. <laughs> mm -mm. Come on, Any time today, man. It's scary now. It's like really frightening. <laughs> Do you like to role play? And if you have, what's the character you have played? Their is daughter is sitting is right next to her. No, she's married. Yeah. Yeah. This is really weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I just want to know something I want. I don't want to hear it, and I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> so have you all, all played a role? You know, these kind of, this is a question that's not for public consumption. So they have played a role. No, we haven't. <laughs> 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 
Men... Det är inte bara att jag har Wednesday Adams. Det var en black hole. <laughs> What? <laughs> no. It was just black. Yeah. Continue. I need an answer. Okay, yes or no? No. No? No. No need. No need. No to. need, yeah. <laughs> oh, no need. Mm. <laughs> Supermodel and gym bar. <laughs> Thank you. All the best. <laughs> to him again. Romesh wins it again. <laughs> What an answer. <laughs> that was actually a really good answer. That was a really yeah. good answer. Yeah, you can check it out. I That's can. Cool. Yeah. I have to. Yeah, you can if you want to. There's like cool stuff in there. Oh, For real, no. I'm not even joking. <laughs> What is this? I don't know. Do I want to see what yeah, this is? Yeah, maybe. You close your mouth. It's not nothing so bad. <laughs> it's kind of well sealed. Yeah, because we don't want it to spill. <laughs> Oh wow. Ah. I see. don't know what that is even. What, what is that? <laughs> what is it? Show me. <laughs> no, I'm not. Scream your own name. <laughs> oh. Can I oh, have that, that one please? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? No. <laughs> what is Look, this? being single oh, is fun for a while. <laughs> what is that? Ah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> Those are the oh, sex checks oh, oh, you can wow. leave back. I don't know what these oh. things are. <laughs> But I'm sure I can, I can Google search. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> it's going to be a It's going to be one nice time in Dubai. <laughs> Again, please don't no traumatize her. <laughs> she's a child, but she's she's way more mature than I am, <laughs> for sure. All right, uh, we have a segment, and it's called Dish the Dirt. We'll see you. What a fun show. Uh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so ha I hope you all are having a good time. No, we, we are, are. We are. are. I'm sure you're... She is a little bit traumatized, but... <laughs> <laughs> That's good. But... The younger days, the young ones are way more advanced than that, that, that's we true. are. Anyway, just oh. wanted to ask you, um, something that I really saw during, the, during your celebration of your wedding here, uh, how, how much of importance you give to faith. And I, I told that when I took that picture with you, mm -hmm. and it was beautiful to know like how, how you all have been brought together as a family and you all celebrate all the blessings you all have got. How has that been so rooted and how have you all channeled it throughout so many years? Am I answering? Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm all of you can answer. Now that Deepak is not a part of the family. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll let her answer that question. I think it's just always been a very prominent thing in our family, like being so rooted in faith, especially like my grandpa um, was very strong in his prayers and everything. And we've seen a lot of things, I've like gone through a lot of things as a family that we wouldn't have made it through without a lot of prayer and faith. So I think there's only one way, you can only be thankful for that, right? And to remember that. Uh, because today it has come to a point where expressing faith is either seen as oh, trying to be pretentious or why do you have to always like show it in my face? Mm -hmm. What is your statement for that? Like especially living in Dubai, so many reasons to be distracted, but yet you find your root always. I just wanted to know, how is it for you? I, I think it's really important to just be real. Um, I think that you shouldn't, I think that if you live by example is more than enough. It's not like you have to scream with the Bible in your hand over to anybody. I mean, if you are, we're trying our best to live it. We're not perfect people. Mm. We have a great time. We enjoy each other's company, company of our friends, and we enjoy, we enjoy life, but we don't pretend to be what we're not. But we still, we know who is in charge at the end of the day and who holds our future. And that is what we depend on. Um, and if you want to add anything to that, Ron. Yeah. Let me, let me put it this way. Um, there's two things that are really important for us. One is knowing who our blessings come from and also being thankful for that and living under that, in, a, in that continuous relationship and not. And the second thing is uh, having relationships with people mm. is really important because people are, despite all the, all the trimmings and everything else that people may have, deep inside they're lonely, they're broken, and they're, 
there everyone's looking for some meaning mm -hmm. and i think if you can if you can be authentic like she said with people in terms of your friendship in terms of how you care it makes all the difference so yeah that's Beautiful. without putting a huge religious yeah. label over it that is true i know the is also very God fearing and yeah, we used to mm -hmm. go to the same church before they went to Dubai. Did you ask them, can I please come along? <laughs> <laughs> please take me. <laughs> um, wanted to ask you, Deepak, as somebody who has been in the modeling industry for so long now, everyone is a supermodel. Yeah. Did you know I'm also a supermodel? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> everyone. <laughs> everyone. You know, you know how many supermodels we have? No, not self as well. Invite, you invite all of them for a wedding because mm -hmm. there would have been an overdose of crowns there. Everyone has a crown at home. Everyone. Do you oh. have your crowns? I wasn't given one. Are you <laughs> You can buy many. No, but you had to five. give yours back. I had to give it back. Yeah, that's I the never normal got way of doing it. it. But thousand five, that's all it is to buy a crown. Okay, it's no. Give her one, please. You have no clue. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tell me, Deepak, what is your definition of a supermodel? Have we had a supermodel? Or do we have one? So, okay, so there's, you can be a supermodel in your own country, and then you can be in like international status, obviously. In my definition, it was girls like Nushi and all at the time. It's the, it's the work you get, and it's how much you get paid for that work. And also, it's your earning capacity. So now it's different with social media and all that. But in my head, like uh, the definition when we were modeling was um, the supermodels are the clients you work with, and you're earning the strength of your earnings. It's not like someone who's getting 2,000 rupees for a show and the next person is getting 20, they both can't obviously categorize them mm. as a supermodel. Like in my head in Sri Lanka, <coughs> sorry, it'll be like Dani Kerkoven, because she's constantly working, she's constantly earning a lot more. But not everyone is, obviously, yeah. Great. Needed to clear that. <laughs> so many out there. After the break, you stick around. All right, so we did some digging. We didn't want to go through what's on Deepak's Facebook or Instagram. Every single, every single picture has been photoshopped and the ugly ones have been untagged. He has just kept everything off his profile. So I did the others. So Deepak will only put up pictures with good-looking people. If you've noticed, I'm not there. Um, and his friend list is also just, okay, they come into my equation because the picture will look nice. And people like, oh, I am using this as a story. <laughs> because in 24 hours, it goes off. Like, you want a picture with me? Lose weight. You want a picture with me? Look good. <gasps> wow. Very, very, wow. very, very rude. It's horrible. Very rude. Oh, yeah. that's my mom and my dad. And it's been four years since mm. mom? It's four years since mom passed. That's a really cute picture. It's actually, this is like uh, the first time in four years we came back to Sri Lanka to celebrate Christmas because it was just too hard to come back home mm. and, and be in the same house. So mom, dad and Chanel and we all celebrated Christmas in However Dubai. However old you are, I think parents are always parents, right? Absolutely. And however old they are, you're always a child. Yeah. yeah. So true, I hate Christmas times <laughs> because of... Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Um, when was this for who? You are supposed to tell memories by holding this. Oh. I told you not to watch the show and come with all the <laughs> research done. No, I didn't. <laughs> this, is, uh, this is me. I did this photo shoot for, I think it was for Darshi. She, I think it was one of Darshi's outfits. Sorry. Where's the outfit? Uh, you haven't taken the rest of it. That's all that was there. Oh, so maybe this was just no, a so profile picture. this uh, picture. So it was for Darshi. She's actually climbing a ladder. Yes, oh. I'm climbing a ladder. Climbing a ladder. Uh, no, she had this massive, no, I took the picture. <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. Was it you that took this picture? So was it Ashane as well? Uh, Ashane, That's Danish, right. And, That's yeah. right. Yeah. Oh, the monkey business. Yeah. Was it called the monkey business? Yeah. Oh. Was that Ashane? I can't. Yeah, no, we would try to start it. Yeah. Oh, oh, that was. That was the last time we were here. That was the last time we were oh, on a date with Dan. That was all of them. 
And now Rian's taller than us all. I remember, I matched the same suit color. I thought y'all would remember, but y'all didn't. Did you really? Actually, you know no, what? In I my did. mind, I was like, it looks very familiar. It's not the same suit. Oh, no, it's okay. not. Okay. Can never fit into it. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I wore the same. This color. is great. That's yeah. a really That's good a great Look at the little one. I you know. should see him now. Yeah. <laughs> he, he, he's, he's that tall. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he really is, though. Yeah. Which that? Oh, oh, that is that that's baby. That's, okay. yeah. Yeah. that's baby. That's baby Tia. <laughs> I couldn't tell if on it was her me or on the christening day or yeah. Uh, now I want to ask you, how, how do you know Aishwarya? I, don't, I know her through her. Ah, because you all took part the same year. That's right. Do you all keep in touch still? Uh, not as much. No, she's a very busy woman. As you can see. Can you tell her that I said hi and just tell her that I if exist? If I do yeah. bump into her, if she comes on and off to Dubai. So this was at a function in Dubai, actually, that we were at together. Because I saw a picture with you and Aishwarya alone that was like going all over social media at one time. That's a picture that she took. Oh. <laughs> when she you know, it. when Aishwarya came to Colombo, yeah. yeah, she was, she requested to see me because, I mean, we were friends during the whole mm. pageant and I was one of the people that she knew in Colombo. So I said, okay, sure, I'll come and spend some time with her and all that. And um, we were just dating at that time. So he goes, well, where are you going? I said, I'm just going to see a friend. And he goes, okay, I've got some other work. I said, if you want, you can come. Uh, and then he goes, um, who are you seeing? I said, I'm going to see Aishwarya. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. yes, I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there. <laughs> what work? What work? No. <laughs> nothing. I have nothing to do. <laughs> Dubai, y'all get to meet cool people. Is yeah. this in Dubai? Yeah, that's yes. in Dubai. That's at his restaurant. Yeah. Uh, and he served everyone. Wow. Yeah, Gordon Ramsay. Well, who took that photo? I mean, uh, that's the life flare. That was a long time ago. <laughs> no, I really thought he was wearing a wig. No, no, that's... That's his, his real hair. Yeah, that's his real hair. Who is this baby number? Three. Three? Three. Oh, this is Rian. Rian. Yeah. This is baby Rian. Ah, that's baby Rian. Remember 13 that? years ago. Yeah. 13 years ago. 13 now, years I remember ago. this show. This was soon after I've joined TV. Mm. This was like all oh, tall girls. And yeah. all tall girls yeah. walked for it. There was no one short. No one had to wear the platforms to get the yeah. height. Everyone was tall. I remember it was at the Golfers Hotel. That's you right. I remember yeah. very well. Yeah. yeah it was in 2000 and. Colombo Fashion Week. No, it was Satya Paul. It was Satya, was, Paul. It's Satya Paul, but wasn't it part of. It the, was. Oh, no, it was uh, just. Satya yeah. Paul exclusive show. Sorry, Deepak, I didn't get pictures of you, but I've done that with no, you before. No, it's fine. Let's do it. Michael Vijay <laughs> Surya. So that was so for uh, Colombo Fashion Week. That was for Colombo Fashion Did Week. Did you walk this year yeah. too? Where are your pictures of these? Yeah, I, I didn't like my outfit. That See, I told you, he untags everything that he doesn't look nice in. Hot pink. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. So oh, well, I took that picture. awful story behind this Tell photo. me the story. This is what you're supposed to do this with this is, segment. Oh, oh. I, when I posted this on Facebook, everyone thought I was dating him. And I was she like, was this so is mad, my right? dad. Did you put a status saying, dad? He posted it actually, and you tagged oh. me. And everyone oh, was really? like, "Oh, is that your boyfriend?" I was like, "No, no, 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 no!" <laughs> oh, <laughs> e, cringe. <laughs> I know. It's uh, sad for the kids. <laughs> so oh. cute. Oh. That was when I could hold real. Y'all produce <laughs> such great babies. Y'all should do more. We should do more, eh? but now I think it's kind of past the no. age. We're past the back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I know. I know. <laughs> the, we, 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 like giving it to others to bring it up. I wish I can free <laughs> kids. I yeah. really do. I mean, then they just grow up and they get married and they leave us Look and they live us. in like Deepak far away lands. Such bad luck. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to be single forever. We'll move in. <laughs> Having said that, I don't think I want to take care of a baby right now. If I no, was no, no, younger, no, you want to have a baby. No, I'm just saying. saying. We'll move in as their baby. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We've been hard to Done. rear. <laughs> uh, before we go, I have to say uh, thank you for being here. Thank uh, you. It has been amazing to have you guys and to like sort of just have you around on like even on media uh, because I think up to date a lot of people consider you as one of the best ambassadors you flew out to represent Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. And it's not even a 
try hard thing. I think it's naturally everyone feels that you're one of the best candidates who represented us very well. And more than anything, I think you did a great job as a girl to represent Sri Lanka. You've done a fabulous job as a wife and you've done an amazing job with the kids. And I think that really shows. And you all are so down to earth, simple, and it's beautiful. Thank you for your kind words. Thank you. I wanted you here because there were specifically there were a few people who called in said, I hope Ramesh is here. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Oh. I, I appreciate it. I don't know, know why, ladies. but... Okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they are ladies, and they were very happy if if you could come, hopefully with nothing, but I said, that's a bit hard. <laughs> and uh, they said, I said, he'll be dressed. Um, yeah, so... Thank you. How weird this is for her to hear. <laughs> I know, she's like, why am I here? Why am I doing this? I'm sorry. <laughs> but it happens when you have hot parents. Uh, anyway, that's why you look fabulous. That's oh, true. Look at you. That's true. Yeah, I always told my mother to have chosen better. <laughs> but anyway, uh, all the very best, and thanks for being amazing. And I wish you all the very best with your whole TV. And and when you do TV, then both of us could do like Canada, Sri Lanka. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> Just poked my way in there. <laughs> Deepak, you know I love you. Oh, yeah, I know. But honestly, thanks for calling me because these guys are... Like, no, I, want, I told like you, a, I want you with them because you have such a long yeah, history long with history, them. Yes. And like you purposely put those pictures up, rep repeatedly reminding me, I'm friends with Dushar. <laughs> <laughs> he no. was there even when she was born at the hospital. Yes, I remember. And Quick yeah. story. Um, yeah. yeah. So she he was, was obviously there when I was born too. Oh, yeah. Really? <laughs> 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 no, so she was the first person I knew who had her who was, who was pregnant. So yeah. when Rom called and said, oh, no, no, she's in the hospital. So I thought the baby just comes out like that. So I ran to the hospital. I was like, where's the baby? Where's the baby? The and Rom's like, yeah, it doesn't happen like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I had to go back and then came back. After. No, I was young. You can, you can hold that. I'm so question. confused. <laughs> How old were you? I was 20. And you thought I didn't know how jump off the clouds? <laughs> I didn't think that she's going to be in labor for, what, 36 hours or something. Yeah, it was a long time. 36 yeah. hours? <laughs> yeah. So, so, it was a long time. It was a day, it was a day, yeah. not 36. But it was long. It was very long, yeah. <laughs> like 35. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, we do wrap things up. Thank you so very much, guys, for being here. Thank I wish you. you all the very best for 2023. And have a great time in Dubai. And if you all ever want me to come and visit you all, let me know. Of course. I'll wait for the ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Tickets are the expensive things now. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, on the note, to wrap things up. Thank you so very much for joining us. We'll see you with another cool episode. Until then, keep smiling. It's a wrap. Right.